Leeds and Reading Festival is one of the biggest music events of the year in the UK and it's finally back this weekend. From Friday August 26 to Sunday August 28, there will be a long weekend of massive headline act as fans travel across the country to celebrate. There has been some disappointing news for festival goers though, as Rage Against the Machine announced they were pulling out of reading due to medical advice. That isn't all, as former Eurovision Song Contest winners Moniskin have pulled out due to a scheduling conflict. Jack Harlow has also cancelled his appearance at the event. There are still many massive names hitting the stage though, including Arctic Monkeys, Megan The Stallion, Bring Me The Horizon and Halsey. Other than the chance to play in front of their fans, the groups will have inevitably been lured to the south and north of England by a potentially big paycheck. How much could headliners be paid? Unfortunately, it isn't public information on how much Leeds or Reading Fest pays its acts. However, there are numerous factors that are involved in paying the performers. One of the most obvious is the level of stardom they have, as the biggest acts who play later in a set will be paid more. The stages they play on will also be a contributing factor, as the bigger the stage means more festival goers in attendance. One of the last major factors is the date, as typically Saturdays are the main event day for these festivals. Bands that headline then are typically paid more than those that head out on a Sunday. It has been reported that UK festivals payment for services have ranged from £1 million for major acts down to £25,000 for smaller performers at some of the nation's biggest fests.